And joining us exclusively from Riverdale, Maryland, is one of Jack McKenna's attorneys, Terrell Roberts. Good morning, sir. Good morning. How is your client, and what kind of injuries did he sustain? He sustained a um, concussion, laceration to his head, a severely bruised wrist, other bruises and contusions. Uh, he's doing he's doing better. Mm -hmm. Was it suggested to him by police that he not report the extent of his injuries? Yes, it was. In fact, uh, when he arrived at the jail, the officer that was with him pulled off a bandage and told him not to report it. We looked at the videotape. What does your client say happened that night? Well, I mean, the, the video, what my client says is precisely what the videotape shows. Mm -hmm. I mean, he is, he's coming down to join the celebration, and uh, as he comes down, he's, uh, he's met there with a phalanx of horses. I think he is sort of like a, a person who walked into a beehive, and he uh, really doesn't understand what's going on. He's standing there trying to grasp what's happening, and then uh, a police, a mounted police officer comes over, mm -hmm. And then, and then uh, three police officers come over and literally attack him and uh, beat him with sticks and uh, beat him down to the ground and continue to beat him. Right. We will looked at this videotape a couple of times now. We see him sort of sauntering up or sort of skipping up to where the, where the horses are. If you were in a situation like that, would not common sense dictate to you to go the other direction if, in fact, what the police say it was correct, that some fires were being set, that rocks were being thrown at police, that some vehicles had been overturned? Wouldn't you like to say, maybe we ought to get the heck out of here as opposed to go directly to the police who are probably agitated to begin with? Well, first of all, I don't think any rocks were being thrown at the police. There were no cars being tipped over. This was a celebration out there, uh, and it's a gathering place for students, and it was a celebration. So he's coming down to join the celebration. Now, I think that he did not appreciate uh, the situation fully, mm. and that was pretty obvious from his uh, behavior. He's skipping down the street. He's happy. and. Uh, He's met there at, the, uh, at a line of police officers. And uh, whether that was a bad decision or not, the fact remains it didn't justify what the mm -hmm. police officers mm -hmm. did. Mm -hmm. What do you want to see happen next? Well, we would want to see the police department identify the officers, the officers who struck this young man and suspend them. We'd want to see the, uh, the authorities conduct a proper investigation and a criminal investigation with respect to the officer's conduct. Uh, of course, a civil suit is going to be planned mm. to be filed for this young man. All right. Terrell Roberts, we thank you very much for your time this morning. Do appreciate it, sir. Sure. All thank right. you. All thank right. you. A lot happens early on The Early Show, weekday mornings on CBS.